Oh, welcome back, Water Signs. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Tisa. So great to have you here. And I am here. I'm looking to next 24 to 48 hours or so, which is uh, March the 12th and the 13th of 2024. Now, everything you need to know about me, it is right down below in our description box. And thank you for your love and your support. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and start pulling your cards now, and let's see what we have here coming up here. Okay. So this is Water, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Please, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio, please. Okay, water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Okay. We have right here, wedding. The situation um, involves a marriage. It says, be yourself right here is what you need to accept. What you need to acknowledge is receive. And then what you need to know, we have the same card right here that you're being helped. This card comes out a lot. Okay, so anybody, let's go ahead and jump into your energy. See, we have going down right here. This is Water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Water Signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. So I'm hearing all things for the good, okay? So for some of you right here, something is for the good in some way. Um... And I'm also hearing you say, how is that good? Something like that. So I'm not sure, but that's some camera right here. An intuitive message. All right. Let's make sure everything is in the upright because I had just seen one card. It was in reverse. Okay, yeah. Some of them is in reverse here. But this card over here, it says having this working behind the scenes to help you, even if you don't see the results right here. You're being helped. There's a little girl at the top right there. We see sharks at the bottom, right? So somebody's being helped in some way. Okay, but I'm hearing like all for the good. Something here is for the good in some way. I just feel like you're like how or why or something like that. <laughs> that kind of feel here, okay? But let me see what it here. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump into it. Having this help is broken behind the scenes to help you. What's the message right here? You're being helped. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel, you're being helped. Somebody's name could be Destiny. I'm also hearing like Destination, something like that right here. Okay, so Eight of Pentacles right here, Nine of Swords. Okay. So Eight of Pentacles is consistent, dedication, focus, mastering something. And Nine of Swords, somebody's having anxiety. Okay, because I feel like you're trying to master something right here. Okay. Um, and with this one right here, look like you're putting something together. Are you putting something together? Like a table or um, a desk or something. Now, that could be the case for some people. All right, but let me see here. What's the message right here, please? You're being helped. Yeah, Queen of Cups right here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio right here. Okay. What's the message right here, please? Okay, yeah, Five of Swords. Hmm. So, something here is a shallow victory right here. Five of Swords. Now, with the Queen of Cups right here, it could be love. It doesn't have to be, but it could be. You know, sometimes the Five of Swords, I mean, the Queen of the um, Queen of Cups could be love, okay? So, if it could be a water sign, or maybe this is you, okay? Something like that, it's here. What's the message right here, please? You're being helped. So, I feel like having this work up behind the scenes to help you, but in some type of way, you feel defeated by something right here. Even though heaven is helping you in some way. Okay. So the five of swords right here in the page of cups. This could be that heaven is broken behind the scenes to let you know that something that you're working on isn't what you want. Could be the case. That's for some, right? And others right here, something that you're working on, it is exactly it is exactly what you want. But heaven is working behind the scenes to help you in some way, though. So sometimes what we want, right, is it what we need or something like that. That also could be what's going on here in some way, okay? So, but heaven is working behind the scenes to help you in some way, okay? It says receive here. When we open ourselves up to others, we open ourselves up to the abundance of the universe right here. Okay, so let's see here. What's the receive card right here? Death card. Okay, could be a Scorpio. 
So you could deal with another Scorpio right here for some of you right here. It says receive card right here. Yeah, because there's two people right there. So for some of you, you're going to receive two lovers or you're going to receive um, another love. That could be a Scorpio here. Ace of Wands right here. Yeah, okay. Some of you, you're really passionate right here about a Scorpio. I'm getting right here, okay? Yeah, even with this one, Scorpio. You're really passionate right here about another Scorpio, I feel, for some people right here, right? Or another love could be the case. Okay. It even could be right here with a death card. If you're not passionate about something right here, maybe it ends, the death card. Could end. Because I feel like you, in order to receive something, you have to be passionate about it. Or they have to be passionate about you or something like that. Okay. Here's another thing. This is two women. Maybe somebody here is, um, you know, in a same-sex relationship. Could be the case. So maybe you have to accept that's the truth about it. Could be the case. Two of swords here. Maybe somebody is into the same sex. Could be the case. All right. Um, here's another thing right here, all right? When you open yourself up to something right here, then the universe can help you because I feel like you're being helped in some way. But two of swords, if you're not open up to it, it's going to end, the death card. It's going to end. If you've been a stalemate or something like that in some way. Okay, so yeah, because maybe you want to be single right here, okay? This could be a Virgo, but maybe you do want to be single, some people here. Yeah, the chariot is reversed right here. Yeah. Okay. So for some people here, you have to receive. Even some message of the universe is letting you know. If somebody's a stalemate, they're really into the same sex for some people here. I feel for some people here. And then others right here, right? It's like there's two people that's here. Okay. But I feel like with the two of swords, you're not open up to something. You're not passionate about something. It's going to end. Some people right here, just pray it. The chariot reverse right here. It's all about if somebody here don't have the structure and discipline in some way right here, the chariot reverse, then something is bound to end. It's like gravity. You don't have the structure and discipline, so it ends then. So I'm getting right here. So I'm kind of getting here, okay? Any other message right here, please? Just receive her. Because I just feel like the universe is bringing something here for you to receive, but... You don't have the structure, discipline, or they don't, or something like that. I feel like somebody knows that you don't, or you know they don't, something right here. Somebody knows they're single, or somebody knows they're a stalemate, that, you know, they know that, something like that. <laughs> or that they're avoiding them, I'm, get, I'm getting something like that. Could definitely be a Virgo right here. I got Virgo twice right here, a Cancer and a Scorpio. And a Virgo again, wow. So this is Virgo right here, this is Virgo. And this one is Virgo. So I'm getting like this Virgo for some people right here. Okay. So I feel like somebody here is consciously aware about something right here. Okay. Somebody's either consciously aware that somebody here is in the same sex or somebody's consciously aware right here that um, somebody's a stalemate, you know. And I feel like somebody's um, manifest manifestation skills is real powerful right here. I could just sense. Okay, because magician and the um, strength card. So I feel like somebody's manifestation skills is really, really powerful. Okay. But if somebody don't have a structured discipline or something is not moving ahead or somebody's a stalemate or whatever, then I just kind of feel like something here is bound to end. It's gravity. Okay. So Knight of Cups right here. This definitely could be a relationship, I feel, for some people here. Okay. So it says right here, be yourself. This situation calls for you to be your authentic self, which is the basis of your personal power. So we have a lot of purple in here is royalty. Purple is royalty. Um business could be. And three of pentacles right here. Okay, so I feel like somebody wants to work together with you. Three of pentacles is all about working together as a team, okay, or getting awarded for something in some way, okay. The devil card right here and the three of wands. Could be a third party here. Yeah, so I feel like somebody had to accept right here, right? That somebody wants a third party. They want to be awarded by a third party or they want to reward a third party. Something like that. To get right here. Could be a Capricorn right here. Okay. Yeah, that's what somebody's plans to do. I'm getting right here. 333, three, three, somebody knows that's their plans to do. I'm getting right here. Yeah. 
their plans right here in a relationship, I feel, is to reward a third party for some people here. Yeah, three, three, and three. Yeah. Right? Or we'll have a third party, something like that. Somebody has to accept somebody's consciously aware. That's not going to work. It's time to move on, I feel. Yeah. It's time to move on from trying to reconcile with this or work, make this work or something like that. It's not going to work. I'm getting right here. When they contemplate something right here about reconciling right here, I feel like 333 is a number of Christ consciousness. Somebody is very much aware that somebody wants to reward a third party or you or whoever. What's the message here, please? Yeah. And they're confident and self assured about it. I feel right here. It could be a fire sign right here. Aries, a Leo. Or Sagittarius right here. Maybe this person's an entrepreneur. Something like that. Yeah, it's something. Some plans over here is too hard, I feel. It's too hard to do. 333, three, three, somebody's been activated. They know right here that, you know, they know that, I feel. Okay. So, wedding, it says, this situation involves a marriage. Okay. What's the message right here, please? What's the message right here? This wedding. You could be married to this person, but somebody's cheating in line. So, they're cheating in line right there. And emerge for some people here. There's some more going on here in a marriage in some way. Something about the marriage and some lies about it in some way here. Right? Yeah, it's about a marriage right here. Right? I feel like they're stuck in a marriage right here. Right? Or when somebody pause review the marriage, it's wishful thinking. Something they was doing right here. Okay? And they think they could use the marriage to reward a third party or something like that. I feel like that's what they was thinking here. It's wishful thinking. Somebody's intuitive, I feel. And not only they're intuitive, they're consciously aware right here, right here, too. So, hmm. yeah, yeah. It even could be religion. Sometimes this is religion. So maybe somebody's consciously aware about religion, right? Or some choice that somebody's making right here. Or if somebody's trying to leave somebody out in the cold or something like that, right? Somebody knows all of their things right there, okay? Yeah, or somebody doesn't want to have sex with them. Something like that. It's wishful thinking. Somebody knows they don't want to have sex with them. Something like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so I feel like somebody wants an investment with no sex. Something like that. Or even somebody here wants to um, be intimate with you, right? But there's a third party over here. And they know that for some people here. Somebody could say, I'm not going to give my money to a third party. Maybe they're going to say that. Some people okay, it could be a fire sign right here. Yeah, so I feel like somebody here, you know, is really happy in a marriage or something like that, okay? Um, but I just feel like they definitely could be cheating and lying. That's wishful thinking. Somebody's intuitive, I feel. Somebody knows about the marriage in some way. Whatever the cheating and lying is about here concerning this marriage, they know about it. The fool, it's going to be unexpected to them or they're going to feel foolish right here. Okay, because somebody's intuitive here, I feel. Yeah, or they're not going to get some money, whatever they plan to do. They're not going to get the money, I feel, right here, because 333 is here, okay? So somebody here is activated. They know over right here that they're a stalemate over here, or they want to get a money to a third party or something like that, you know, something like that. <laughs> yeah, that's the truth right here. King of Swords, that's the truth right here. So, you know, the something's not going to work like that, I get a sense. They have to be realistic about something right here. I feel like they're in the dream world. It's a tower, tower moment right here for somebody right here. To realize that, I kind of feel. So, you know, that's what I have here, okay? Let me see if there's any last message right here for water signs. It's Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Yeah, you know, they would have to make a practical decision right here to stop lusting in some type of way. Well, somebody here is going to learn from this whole ordeal right here to make practical decisions before they do something impulsively could be the case here, okay, in this new cycle right here. So anyways, this is what I have here, okay? Thank you so much for taking a look, and we'll get back together again soon, and I send you all peace, blessings, love, and light. Namaste to you.